in bio memory level all of us are deeply connected the intensity of the inner world manifests as continuity in the outer world and continuity of the outer world manifests as intensity of the inner space next statement i am going to make i am making multiple independent statements in this satsang listen to this satsang 3 4 times you will understand the multiple independent statements are all connected sutre manigana iva the message today i spelled out the first few lines from that message just see all the independent statements i am making they are all connected like sutre manigana iva next statement i am making listen. length dimension expanding in its infinite possibilities gives birth to breadth dimension breadth dimension and length dimension expanding with their infinite possibilities give birth to depth dimension length dimension breadth dimension depth dimension all three together expanding with its infinite possibilities give birth to time dimension length breadth depth time all four giving birth to its infinite possibility and expanding gives birth to space dimension at some day scientists will prove what i am saying i am just mapping some of the greatest principles of 36 tattvas described defined in the cosmic knowledge and penned in sanskrit i should not say penned spelled that's the right word because vedas are spelled not penned penned much later to protect it from invaders otherwise it is only spelled that is why it's called shruti heard shruti heard the cosmic truths spelled in vedas i am just mapping it to the english language and sharing it with you all now what i described as the length breadth depth time space understand the time and spaces continuum continuum of time space is intensity in the inner space subjective world it is dependent on continuity in the objective world listen in the external world which all of us are perceive in certain frequency like sound how between this frequencies it can be perceived by all of us there is some scale between this unit to this unit all of us can hear if it goes down then this unit normal human beings can't hear but if you start hearing the lower frequencies than the human possibility it's called power or the higher frequencies than the human possibility it's called power 
whether lower frequency or a higher frequency, then the human possibility is called power. Same way, this world, there is certain frequency which all human beings can perceive, but that does not mean human beings cannot perceive the lower frequency or higher frequency. The commonly stated range of human hearing is to 20 to 20,000 hertz frequency. Same thing, I can roughly equate. Even the visual, please listen. Common human perceived time space. I will give a for example 20 to 20,000 units. Maybe instead of hertz, I will call that unit as maya. 20 unit to 20,000 unit maya, all of us can perceive. Below 20 unit, above 20,000 unit, anyone can perceive he is liberated from maya. 